Hello everyone and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. My name is Melanie V. We are now on to episode 58 and day 115. So last time we got section 8 expansion, which is back here. Um, I didn't really have anything to place in here. So we just moved some stuff around. Got three shelves back here. I think we can probably get some shelving along this wall as well. We'll see. We might not even need it right now. So I was going to purchase some more shelving, but I don't think I need to write as yet. So let's go into market and we are going to take those shelves out of there. And we got bills to pay. Let's go ahead and do that. Pay that and that. And... We don't really have anything else to get done right now, so we might as well open up. Here we go. So we have a lot of space here now. I don't know. We can probably like fill a shelf with some more products, but what products? I feel like we have enough of everything. Like maybe the sugar, because this is kind of split up down here. That is one thing we could move. But then we'll have to mess up our sugar section. What else can we do? We have like a teas down here that are split up as well. Maybe we can combine these and get them onto their own rack, but that was gonna take up one, two, three, four. So yeah, it's not gonna have enough to fill an entire shelf. What else can we move over there? We need something that we just have like tons of. Maybe we should get the toilet papers onto their own racks. So like if we fill like two full racks, just toilet paper. So like one, two, three of these regular toilet paper. So we can get like a fourth one. And then the same with these uh, green ones. We'll have like four on our rack. But then what are we going to put on this bottom row? I don't really have that much cleaner stuff. Maybe some of this bleach because these are really big bottles and they can probably take up a little extra space. What else can we move around though? So yeah, I think maybe we'll have to do something with the bleach and then we can get some more of this type of cleaner and this type of bleach as well. But we don't need to do that right now because we're not selling out of it anyways. Um, not that busy in the store right now. Let's actually go check out our management menu again. Of course, as the minute I leave or the second I leave, actually, someone's there. I do want to check out what's the next license we want to get. Okay, we'll come back. Um, out of here, let's go up to our till and help our customers. Hello, ma'am. Your total comes to 140.75. Whoa, that is an excellent start. And this order is going to be 70.25. Not bad. We can work with that. Thank you, sir. And another big order. Now I wonder if we can top out our customers. Like our top customers we've had so far was 68. So if we can get to like 70, that would be amazing. Okay, ma'am, 56.50 and 50 cents change. Okay, do we have time to get away? Yeah, let's turn on the lights here too. Oh, see, a second I leave, customer is there. So I do want to get some licenses. And the next one is at level 56. But we are currently at level 48. We've got a long ways to go. Now, I think by ordering stuff, we can increase our level. So that is something we're going to have to do. But let's get through these customers. Okay, sir, $12.50. 
Hey, have a good night. Okay, well, it's not been very busy. But I think we made quite a bit today nonetheless. I don't think we got to the goal of having so many customers, though. That would be crazy. Okay, ma'am, 139.75, no change needed. And I think it's safe to close up now. Let's go ahead and do that. Did she come from outside and went straight into the line? Uh, that's kind of weird. Okay, it doesn't look like anyone wants to come over to our till. I want to check on our confectionaries. Definitely want to get some more space freed up back here from these boxes that's been sitting on the floor. Let's see how much we can get out. Okay. Ooh, the box is empty. Yes. Um, did someone just come into the store after I closed? What's going on here? He had a bag in his hand too. That is so strange. Are people walking outside of the store? And then deciding to come pay? Why? <laughs> that is kind of odd. Okay, let's see. Can we get some of this cake onto the rack? Got a couple there. Still a whole box full to go. Um, oh, and there's still so much in this other box, too. Well, things are not looking good for our, our confectionery. We'll load some of these up, too. Oh, is this one done? <gasps> yes, it is. Hooray! Into the trash. Let's get the next box. Chocolates, here you go. And just a few more that can go out, but that's better than nothing. They keep running into people. They'll be fine. They'll get over it, I think. And last but not least, let's see if we can get some candy out. Nothing there. We can get two right there. Eventually, we'll get these off the floor. Um... These are not probably all full boxes here. Might have to trade those out. Okay, got one customer there. No customers on that side. Now, what about back here? Oh, one thing we'll need for back here is some lighting. One, two, three, maybe four. Yeah, we'll get four lights in there. Let's go put that on our list right now. So we need one, two, three, four. That's too much. There we go. And we should probably see what else we need to restock. Definitely toilet paper as usual. Okay, let's do that right now. Um, there we go. We're full. Our cart is full anyway. No customer, no customer. It's okay for us to close up. So today we had 63 customers, only one complaint about pricing. That's good. Nobody had any, nothing was like missing from the shelf. So that's another good thing. And overall we had a profit of 11.39, not bad. Uh, veal, chops, cake, and sliced bread. Which cake is change in price? This one. And veal chops. Uh, Some place around here. Um, Is it this one? Here it is. Oh, it's much lower. Let's go at 11.50. And we need to change the price of our sliced bread, which is back here now. And we'll make it three dollars and seven. 
There we go. So I think it's okay to open up. Let's make sure to place our order though. Because we're going to need some toilet paper. Oh, look at this tower. And there it goes. <laughs> I'm surprised it lasted that long. Let's see if we can get some of these on the shelf. Okay, and we're going to need a bunch of the green kind. We'll get that loaded up next. That is not the green kind. You stay there. I should probably close my tail in the meantime. Okay, so we only have one in this box. Hopefully someone comes and grabs this right away. Let's stick that there. And I'm going to close my tail. Done. Okay, I need to get some stuff on the shelf. Um, we'll put the toilet paper away, then we can set up our lighting. I think I placed those toilet paper in the wrong spot. But I think it's going to be just fine. So we have an extra of the green. I'm sure we'll get through it though. Um, let's just place it here for now. And now for our lights. Can I put up lighting for... What? No wonder people were coming... <laughs> They're grabbing stuff through the window. I need to seal up this window apparently. <laughs> okay, I can't put the lighting up from outside though. Okay, one light right there. And we got three more to go. So since we opened up this section back here, people are coming instead of like, you know, walking around, like through here, they're going outside to get this stuff. That is crazy. But just as long as they're paying for it, it's all good. If they were stealing, that would be bad. But they're not. These are good people. Okay, last light. It's already 1.30. Oh my goodness. Let's get this one right about there. And we'll turn on our lights for today. There we go. It's already pretty busy in here. So I'm going to open up the till. Going to step away. I don't really need to have these shelves back here. I can put them back where they were before. But it doesn't really make a huge difference anyway. Okay, our first customer of the day. And $93, please. 93 Thank you very much. Second order, not as good. Just $35.75. I guess we'll still take it, though. $35.75. There we go. Well, I ultimately would still like to get to this. 70 customers in one day. That would be pretty amazing. And I would like to get to like 6,000 in sales. Maybe we can get that done today. Let's give it a try. Oh, this is a big order. Ma'am, your total comes to 181.25. There you go. Well, it is 9 p.m. Almost time to close up the shop. Um, is there people coming in? I'm going to let a few more people come in, though. Because I want to make some more money. There you go, ma'am. $3 change. 
How are you tonight, sir? Yeah, I see you got a lot of rice there. Your total comes to 121.75. Hey, have a good night. And sir, your total is $69. There you are. Have a lovely evening. Okay, well, I think it might be safe to go ahead and close up now. There's that customer leaving to go get something through the window. <laughs> oh, there's someone waiting. And so your total is 157.50, 250 change, there you go. Yeah, I think it's okay for us to go ahead and close up now. There's a few people in the store still. Nobody wants to walk back here, it seems though, so. I don't even know how he's getting that honey. That is um, odd. Is that area back there cursed? Why is this person just standing here? My till is still open. Sir, I can help you over here. Sir. Sir, stop standing there. My till is open. <sighs> you much rather go in one of these other lines, I guess. Oh, well. Let's see if we can get some of our candies out. There's just a few left in this box now. What about the chocolate? Let's see here. Can we get the chocolates all on the shelf and empty this box out? Oh my gosh, we can. Ta-da! Another box gone. And we got a whole bunch of cake. So close to emptying this box. We're almost there. Um, I bet you I can swap out one of these boxes. Eh, we're not going to worry about it. Let's just leave this here. And can we get this on the shelf? It's hard to get rid of this pasta stuff. I've got so much, but nobody seems to like it. Okay, well, we can empty this box at least. Trash. Maybe let's grab another one. Get some more out on the shelf. And I do have some space down here. Might as well use it. Okay, I think maybe all the customers are gone now. Let's see if we can fill up this customer there, customer there. No. Okay, we didn't quite get all of this gone. Eventually we will. But I think it's safe to go ahead and close up now. So for today, 64 customers, not the greatest. And income for today, only 5,400. I thought we were doing much better. How disappointing. Oh, well, well, I guess that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.